Uh, John Russell here with three-time world champion William Joppy, man. Guys, for everybody, Roberto Duran, Felix Trinidad, uh, B Hop. Oh, Lucian Boutsa, I didn't even think about that. Yeah. You know, the guy you fought him, he was actually um, on a, on a cut up when you fought him. Yeah, um, I fought them guys during the end of my career, you know. Well, you know, I kind of like falling off during, during that time, but um, hey, I got, I got rolled with the punches. Speak to me about um, what you thought about Felix Trinidad being uh, considered for the Hall of Fame. Why not, you thought he, he shouldn't be considered? He should not ever, ever come close to the Hall of Fame. Not even on the bottom tier of the Hall of Fame because he's been illegally wrapping his hands. You know what I mean? How, that's like if I got in a street fight with somebody and I got brass knuckles on. Wow. He's cheap. But now Hopkins exposed him back in 2001. He should never come into the Hall of Fame. Mm -hmm. If he do, I'm going to make a whole lot of noise about it. Mm -hmm. I mean, think about it. I mean, these guys using steroids, they should never be become Hall of Famers. Never. Uh, that's my that's that's my story, and I'm sticking with it. <laughs> I hear you, yeah. man. So retirement's treating you pretty good. Yeah, you're man. training guys. You yeah. got a lot of guys that you're training right now. Right, right. You also got a charity that you're working with. Yeah, Breakfast with Boxers. Tell us about it. You have a website for it. Yeah, Breakfast with, yeah, www.breakfastwithboxers.org. Okay. Go to it, check out, uh, you know, upcoming events that we're doing. Uh, Breakfast with Boxers is an organization that I came up with in 2011. We go to homeless shelters. We feed the homeless folks. We don't just drop the food off. We prepare the food. We sit down. We break bread with them. We talk to them. Give them a word of encouragement. We do. I take other professional boxers in, uh, with me. And we do boxing exhibition for them. We give them a little entertainment and inspire them to, you know, to get back up, and push, don't give up. Because the worst thing you can do when you come up against adversity in your life is to give up. Mm -hmm. Paul said you must, you know, you must get back in the race. You know what I'm saying? Don't never stop. Now, uh, Life is a race. And we all we all have our stamina blocks. But the worst thing you can do is don't get back up and get back in the race. You got to get back in the race. Reference with boxers, man. Yeah, I, yeah. I like it. How long has it been going for? How long two, now? Uh, two years. Since two years. Lab, yeah. And everybody so, can find out, sign up for it on the yeah, website yeah, yeah. if they yeah, want. Yeah, check my website out, www.breakfastwithboxers.org. Okay. Check it out. We're doing big things. Right. We're trying to grow. We're growing. And if anybody wants to contact you regarding uh, appearances or doing anything like that, they can find you through there? Find me on my website. Okay. All right. Okay. Now, the middleweight division, as you see it now, obviously it's not like it was when you was fighting. Um, you got some respectable guys like Andre Ward, some guys uh, coming up, Peter Killen, uh, Triple G, you guys heard of. Um, Who's, who stands out to you in this division? Well, Andre Ward, man. I mean, he, out of all them guys, them guys are pretty good. You just named Triple G, Peter Killen, but Andre Ward is uh, awesome, man. Mm -hmm. That guy's a great fighter, man. And uh, I see him holding the crown for him. I see him holding the crown just like Bernard Hopkins. Mm -hmm. I see him doing the same thing, man. He, wow, he, for that he, long. Uh, yeah, he's clean. He's clean. Out, it's all about how you living outside, uh, outside the ring. So I see him holding down for a long time. I got mad respect for Andre Ward. Uh, I don't see him losing no time soon. Easily, do you think he instantly holds the number one spot after Floyd leaves? In of your course, opinion? Of course, yeah, 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 of course. Okay, can't man. Put him on, can't put him over Floyd because Floyd been there longer. Okay. okay. But yeah, uh, he's all yeah, right there. He's right there. He's an awesome guy, man. And, I, and also, I like him, man. I like him outside the ring. He's a good guy. Right. He's right. a good guy, yeah. Three time world nice. champion, William Jobby. Thanks for your time here with John Russell on FightHype.com. Appreciate it, man. Thank you.